All right, so you want to know about it. The iOS 11.4 and above jailbreak. Where is it? Now, before I go into store, I want to give a shout out to our video sponsor today, which is Coca-Cola. No, I'm just kidding. It's SED key. And basically what they are is a fantastic website where you can buy Windows software and most importantly, a bunch of games. Let me just give you guys a little tour. So up top, you got Steam, Origin, Xbox, Uplay, PlayStation, PC games, gift cards, and more. Over here, you can save up to 40 42% off, so you can basically save on every game that you buy. So if you do want to buy a game, go and check out this website. They'll probably have it for cheaper, so you could save money and still have a lot of fun playing these games. Check this out. We got a Doom Theme CD key for only 10 bucks, less than that, actually. Scrolling down, we got Xbox gift cards, PlayStation gift cards. You get them for a lot cheaper on this website, so go and check them out. I'll put a link down below in the description. It's worth it. They also do have a 24-hour support team if you want to go and talk to them. Anyways, I would highly recommend checking out SCD key. Go and use that my link down below in the description. There are some triple A games coming out that I'm super excited for, so you want to keep this website in mind. All right, so huge thanks to SED Key for sponsoring this video. That really helps out the channel. Your guys' support just means a lot. It really keeps the videos coming and allows me to do what I do. But anyways, back to the iOS 11.4 Joe Break. Let's go ahead and talk about it. So backtracking a bit, the Electro team did release a Joe Break for iOS 11.3 through 11.4 Beta 3. So it wasn't actually released for the official software iOS 11.4. 11.4, but it was released up to iOS 11.4 beta 3. Now that has made some confusion because people are like, okay, so I, my device, if I go into settings and I go to general and I go to about, I am running version iOS 11.4, but this is the official release. It's not the beta 3 version or lower. So the jailbreak will not work on this device as of right now. Only if you're on beta 3 or below will the jailbreak work on iOS 11.4. So yeah, guys, it kind of sucks for me too, because my original iOS iPhone 10, the face ID stopped working and I did have to get my iPhone 10 swapped out and this new iPhone that I have right here, I just got it yesterday, is running iOS 11.4 so right now it cannot be jailbroken. Alright, so what's with the new jailbreak? When is it coming for iOS 11.4, the official release? Now there is some good news. So a security researcher known as Min Spark Zhang, we're just gonna, that's what we're going to call him, he's from Alibaba and basically he recently outlined two new bugs and this was on August 10th. These bugs were for iOS 11.4 and it was during his presentation at the DEF CON 26 hacking conference in Las Vegas. So he showcased two new bugs and they are possibly going to lead up to a jailbreak for iOS 11.4. Now, in my personal opinion, I think we will see a jailbreak for iOS 11.4 after iOS 12 is released to, to the public next month. So that's pretty cool. So you have to decide if you want iOS 12 or the new jailbreak. Now, the part that sucks about these bugs being found in iOS 11.4 is that the security researchers did send them to Apple and Apple did patch these bugs in their new iOS 11.4.1. So if you're on iOS 11.4.1, chances that you'll get a jailbreak are a lot lower and if you're on iOS 11.4, just iOS 11.4, then you, we may be seeing a jailbreak pretty soon. Now, what sucks even more if you're on iOS 11.4.1 is that iOS 11.4 has stopped being signed, so you can no longer go back and downgrade to iOS 11.4 if you do want a jailbreak. So that's very unfortunate. So if you guys are on iOS 11.4 right now, stay there. Do not update. Otherwise, you cannot go back to iOS 11.4, so you can no longer jailbreak in the future. Now, with some more news, a developer known as Brandon Azad, he is also expected to talk about a potential iOS 11.4 11.4 jailbreak next month at a security conference in Hong Kong. So again, more bugs are going to be found and basically we're going to be seeing a jailbreak for iOS 11.4 pretty soon. Hopefully once these bugs are unveiled, the Electro team will get soon to work on it. So yeah, I really want a jailbreak, so I cannot wait. I mean, on iOS 11.3 when I was jailbroken and I had all those tweaks installed, it just added so much functionality that was missing in iOS. Some things that I wanted there and it's just super annoying not having them anymore. Like just something as simple as closing out apps, I could just go ahead and swipe over like this instead of tapping and holding and just swiping like that. It's super annoying. Having emojis on my keyboard at the bottom right there, being able to move my cursor just by sliding on the keyboard like this instead of force touching. 
which is a lot easier. I don't know, getting page animations, getting animated background so the background moves and stuff. Ah, oh, there's so much I guys could do with the jailbreak that I already miss. But yeah, guys, that's basically all the news I need to know about the iOS 11.4 jailbreak right now. And on top of that, we have iOS 12 coming out. So I'm super excited with that. Let me know if you guys want me to make a separate video on iOS 12 and some features that will be coming to iPhone, iPad, and iPod Touch. Anyways, again, check out SCD key. Link will be down in the description. Have a great rest of your day, guys. Peace out.